Most of you remember Sarah Von Weber, former drummer of Let's Active. Now Sarah lives with her family in Carbo, North Carolina. The Von Webers are pretty well known around here. Her brother, Joe, is lead singer in UV Prom. Her sister, Monica, a rock and roll devotee. And then there's little brother Dexter, who moved his bedroom into a building behind the house. He calls it the mausoleum. Dexter is no poser. He loves American rock and roll and lives it 24 hours a day. I really don't know what else to tell you about Dexter. He's the kind of kid that would take a long time to get to know. Welcome to the Mars. This is where I spend my time. It's where I spend my time growing up. And drinking beer. <laughs> that, ain't, that ain't true. That ain't true. Um, I'll give you a brief tour of the place. It's not really that, you know, people think it's a big deal, but it ain't a big deal. It's just home. I'll tell you personally. Rounding the Gothic cornice, here is my bed. I spend many a lonesome night in this bed. And overlooking the bed is the Rock of Ages. We got Elvis at 19 with a stack of That's All Right Mama records that he recorded in 1954. Um, his shirt's off and he's looking slim. He's just looking real good. It's probably the best Elvis ever looked. That's Elvis Presley right there. Then below him, we have Richie Valens, who's me and it's our band's current favorite. He's, I mean, we got a record by him and we listen to him all the time and he's just the greatest. And before him, Buddy Holly. And God, Buddy Holly's just my tremendous idol. I don't know. He's just, I, I don't know him, but I love him. <laughs> and below him, Gene Vincent. And the, there's never gonna be a wildest rocker ever again. And then Little Richard. And he ain't rocking no more, just like the rest of them aren't rocking no more. It's kind of our uh, shrine to the rockers. And uh, moving around. This is my first silver tone guitar that I brought to school with me and crooned to a young lady. And it's broken now, but there's many, there's many memories in this baby. It'll be working soon. And then the coffin table, right here. This baby, this is... Big John. We got this the night we moved into the mausoleum. But we went out in the woods and got it by the railroad tracks. And, uh, let's see. Oh. This is what gave me the inspiration for this place. That's my, my father, my mother. Uh, very nice, very nice couple. So... This is my uncle Edgar. Uh, he passed away. But we're all very fond of him. Come on over here, fellas. This is our shrine. It's a soul brother number one. Bad man Brown. Coming to the Mars, and I'm always around because this is a lonesome town. But then again, all towns are lonesome. <laughs>